Hi, I'm Lee Hoag, uh, here today uh, at Made in New York 20, 2021 with my piece, Pull It Together. Um, I work with collected objects and I don't begin with an idea uh, or a sketch or you know anything in mind that I um, then look for the objects. I am first attracted to the objects as uh, potential material to work with. Um, and then as I put the objects together, they start to uh, come together and, and an idea forms from that. Um, sometimes, as with this piece, um, that process can be extended a few years. Um, I had started with uh, this element here and this element here, and actually this was on top of it this other way and it was down uh, flat there and it sat in my studio f like that for a long time as I then went and worked on other pieces. I, I work on a number of pieces at the same time. And so it sat dormant for a while and oftentimes pieces of mine will. And then some other new object comes in or even objects that were in the studio um, kind of doing their own thing, you know, together. All of a sudden uh, with this piece, the elements just came together um, and, and pulled together as one form um, uh, as I was getting ready for an exhibition uh, this past uh, spring. But again, it's just, um, it's very uh, much uh, serendipity in that um, I may come across another piece that all of a sudden triggers me to think of it in relationship to something that sat dormant for a while. And uh, again, that was how, how this piece came, came about. There's an element of, uh, of, of mystery in that you, there are objects in there that you may recognize, so there's sometimes a familiarity, but as they come together into some totally different thing collectively, um, you know, they often appear like they um, have, you know, some purpose, you know, some, uh, in some other world, some other place, um, you know, like that they do something or, and so there's that element of mystery and um, in that you, you know, are familiar with the objects but unfamiliar with what this new thing is. Uh, also, too, there's, um, uh, in that the objects are things that, you know, we know what they have a history, whether they were a history used for something or just the history of what it was in, made and intended to be used for. Um, that those labels that we, the language we use to label those things, a vase or a pot or a tray or um, uh, a fence post cap, um, all these things that they, as they come together, they those terms kind of slip away and, and, and new things come to mind um, that are drawn not just from my imagination but the viewer as they, you know, what they see and what, what comes to mind from their own uh, past associations and, and memories.